Super Duper Gamer here. This is the Escapists. Wait a minute. Wait for it. There it is. There it is. This is the Escapists. So this is 2015. Uh, this is a uh, uh, 2010's Thursdays. We play 2010's game. This is a new game on my channel. Uh, I have never played this before. It is, I think, about eight years old. So yeah. So if you want to watch somebody play this for the first time, probably almost anyone who's been interested in it has already played it. This is my first first time, so uh, we'll see my... I recognize this music from something. Is this really the Escapist music? I've heard this music on something else. Maybe it's like free music, so I think this is kind of an indie game. Alright, so anyway, let's start a game. New game. Uh, Escapist is a... I think it's like a crafting game, and you gotta escape from a jail or something. Uh, we can pick our different peoples here. We got Billy Goat, old, old timer Tango. Is Tango? Ooh, Tango. I'm gonna be Tango. Can I change my name though? Uh, name too short. Oh, I can pick a name. Look at that. Look at that. The real. Oh wait, Tango. Right. Okay. Continue. Just do ish. Oh, they they changed the um. They changed it so I can only have an uppercase at the beginning. Well, and of course, it's going to be Super Duper Gamer, and this is going to... Oh, it doesn't even fit. Ugh, it doesn't fit. Okay, so fine. SDG Super Duper Gamer. There we go. Let's do this. Uh, select a prison. Uh. Ah, so it looks like these are grayed out. Oh, I can't even pick them. So I'm forced to do the tutorial. So let's do the tutorial together. This would be fan. Escaping good times. Well, this is it. Time to put this plan to the test. All the preparation and hard work boils down to this. Let's get to it. Use the W, A, and S, and D keys to move your prisoner. Oh, by the way, this is in full screen. Um, hopefully things don't look too distorted. I don't know how to make it less distorted. Uh, okay, it looks like we got stuff down the side there. Looks like my face is blocking stuff a little bit so i'm gonna move my face a little bit yeah okay let's put me right there that looks good let's put me there oh wait a minute we're gonna be very ocd about this okay that's fine all right so let's see we got ben Ooh, chris oh and this is me okay can i talk to ben or chris move your move to your desk and left click to open it Take all the items from inside. I'm pressing that W A S D keys. Then oh, okay, there we go. Looks like can I go through that vent? Cable T. Oh, that's a TV. Looks like a vent. Oh, this is a hallway, not a duct. Okay, Ugh, okay. There's a hallway here too. So let's see. Can't open the door. What is this cable TV? Oh, I turned the TV on. Look at that. So, I guess the keys are... Can I turn the TV off? No, I cannot turn the TV off. Okay. Fine. And then with the bathroom? Dispose items. Ooh, okay. We dispose of items through the toilet. Nice. Desk. Okay. Ah, okay. There we go. So, we got a screwdriver. 100%. I guess that means it breaks at a 0%. I don't know. And a sock. Those are two very strange items to be having together in one place. Move to your desk and left click to open it. Take all of the items. What if I just want the sock? Can I leave now? Nope, I cannot leave. Oh, the TV shut off. How did that happen? Well, it's going on. Give me that. Okay, fine. We got the... Ooh. Right click to use. Right click is used to pick up and drop desks. Move your desk to the highlighted position. All right. Ooh. It's like a ghost desk here. Oh, it wants me to move it there. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Right click. Boom. Left click. Right click. Huh? Stand beside the desk and tap towards it to climb it. This allows you to see the vent layer. Ooh. See, I, th I thought there were, I thought I saw like a video of this years ago and it looked like you were climbing through the, the air duct vent systems. So that's what that's about. Okay. So that's not a vent, that is the TV. And the TV keeps shutting off on me. So if I wanted to dispose of items... Wait, how do I see my inventory? Yeah, oh, inventory's over here. All right, so can I grab... Okay, so it looks like now I have the screwdriver activated. Can I dump the screwdriver in the toilet? No. Doesn't look like... Can I clog the toilet with the sock? 
No, this is kind of like an, um, what is that? It looks like a pacifier. Profile, or it's a stamp? What is it? Journal? Oh, we got a lot of journal. Oh, and crafting. Let's click crafting. Craft. Oh, there's nothing to be crafted. Okay. Cra oh, the crafting. Journal. Can't read the journal. This is the tutorial, so they're not letting me do stuff. Okay, so we're up here. Left click on the screwdriver, because we got to open the vent, right? So let's just do that. Unscrewing. Look at that. We unscrewed it. Okay, once inside, make your way to a nearby cell. Well, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Who we got here? We got Ben and Chris. Who should I go visit first? Can I visit both of them? Vent is 100%. Oh, it looks like I can only visit Chris because he's got a thing over top of his place. So if I try to... What is this thing? How do I... Oh, what is that? What's that? What's that yellow thing? Is that like telling me where to go? Is that a bird? What is that? All right, I got a uh, vent by left clicking on it, okay? Oh, okay, so I had to click on the hole to climb up. Yeah, that yellow thing up there is moving with me. I don't know, that's not my mouse. My mouse is the green thing. So I don't know what that's about. Oh, can we click on this? No, okay, so there's something blocking our way. Can we use a screwdriver on it? No. Can we use a sock on it? No, okay. So we gotta just go this way, I guess. Got some nice lullaby music going, by the way. Background, very quiet. Okay. Ooh, is that a guard? It might be a guard. So this is kind of a stealth-based game, I guess. I don't know. I think it's kind of a multi-genre uh, sort of game. They don't make a lot of stealth games anymore. I like stealth games. Most, A lot of games have stealth in them, but they don't actually make solid stealth games anymore very much. Uh, oh, the screwdriver's been used, 90%. It looks like... Okay, I need to use a screwdriver on this vent. Unscrewing. 80% of screwdrivers. So we're going to use the, the screwdriver eight more times, I guess. So let's just drop down by click. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh, okay. So the yellow thing is the indicator telling me where to go. So let's click. All right, we fell down here. The, fl the flashing bag icon over Durden's head means he has items to sell. Right click on him to open up his profile. Can I turn on his TV? Look at that. Can I break his TV with the screwdriver? No, I cannot. Okay. Can I open this door? Okay, that's a Officer Fragile? <laughs> I guess we can break him pretty easily. How will we break the guard? Give him the sock. Maybe he start crying or something. I don't know. Whoa, look at that. Okay, we can, okay so we can climb up onto this. Oh. So I can move this, right? There. So now I can get back up in here if I wanted to. So he got a, a, a golden bag over his head. Let me right click. Oh, we got strength. So we could beat this guy up and take his stuff, right? Inmate outfit. We can undress him? What is this? Come on, this is supposed to be a uh, family-friendly channel here on Super Duper Gamer, right? Uh, let's see. Unem unemployed. Oh, well. Ooh. Holy moly, I can give him a whole bunch of money. I have 10 bucks? Where does it say I have 10 bucks? Give, I'll give him zero bucks. No, it doesn't work. Soap. Let's give him a dollar. Let's just be nice. Maybe he'll be our friend if we give him a buck. We're not able to do that. Maybe because we have no money. I don't know. What is this? Soap. We can buy soap for zero dollars? I'll take that. Great. Now you can craft a weapon. Open the craft menu and add the two items. What, you put the, the soap bar in the sock and then you can swing it around and hit somebody? Is that probably what it is? Let's see. I can't take I can't undress dirt dirt and so let's get out of there. Let's go to the craft menu. Craft. No. Great. Now you can craft a weapon. Open the craft menu and add the two items. Sock. Ah. Yeah, and soap. See? Yeah, so now we got a sock mace. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right. So that's gonna hurt uh, Officer Fragile, I think. Profile. It wants me to Open profile. Okay. First, I got to close this menu, I guess. Then we go to profile. SDG. Um, weapon. Oh, we got to equip the weapon. Oh, my gosh. Okay. There's a lot of steps involved to do all this stuff. Uh, now, let's try it out. Press space to toggle combat mode on and off. With it on, click on the guard to target him. Okay. So, wait. The door's unlocked all of a sudden? How'd that happen? So space bar. Okay, so look, the little flying birdie thing I called it, the little 
arrow thing at the top of the screen that's now red which i guess means attack mode so we're in non-attack mode so if we just walk up to this guy oh man he just lets me walk around look at that why is the screen all cloudy it's kind of cloudy that's bad Oh, he doesn't mind. He doesn't mind if I just walk right past him. Look at that. All right, so just target him. Oh, turn off. Don't want him. To st there we go. Ooh, look at that. Ouch. If you stand next to the unconscious guard and left click on him, you can loot his items. Grab his outfit. Ooh. Really? Okay. All right. Now we got to play dress up. So we got to equip that. Okay. So it's multiple steps here. That's okay. So we got to go in here. Click that. Click that. Now we're equipped. It would be nice if there was a hotkey or something. Just do all that automatically. Let's Looks good. Now go outside to the right and head north past the guards where your exit awaits. Uh-huh. So is he dead? Or is he just... He naked. He naked. Well, I should tell Durgan. He can... Dur Durgan. He can leave now. Ooh, I can target him. Look at that. No, it's not letting me attack him. Is it because... Oh, I lost my weapon. I can only use it once, I guess. I can go in and out of here. Can I buy anything else from this guy? No. Can I go back up? Let me see here. So you climb onto the... Climb onto there, and then... What? Searching? What is that about? Oh, oh, I didn't know. Click cable TV. How do I get back up? Maybe... Maybe it just doesn't want me to do that because it's a tutorial. Unless I, I didn't... I'm confused. Let's, uh... So I could actually put my inmate outfit back on. Is that right? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look at that. I do still have my weapon. Okay, so let me swap back. I probably should have the guard outfit on. I gotta use profile to do that. That's weird. Profile? Wouldn't that be, like, equipment screen, or... What is... To okay, what does journal say? Journal? I can't read the journal still. So, okay, so if I hit spacebar, I'm in attack mode, and I can swing at people. So can I swing at Durgan? No, okay, so it doesn't, it won't let me attack him. Okay, so can we go through, are those doors? Those are supposed to be doors, I guess. I don't know what that's about. I don't think those are doors. Maybe those are like crates or something. I think those are supposed to be crates. Oh, apparently we didn't need a key. We can just go right out through this door. Welcome, new guy. <laughs> okay. Can I hit these guys? That's a question. Can I save, actually? If I hit escape... Ah, okay, look. Like this. Okay, so I could go... See, I could go window mode. Alright, see, now everything is kind of boxy. I don't know if everything's supposed to be boxy. If I go full... So, yeah, I don't know... Hopefully things don't look distorted. I think everything looks aspect ratio okay. See, so I look at the sprites there, like officer lo loiter... <laughs> So if I switch the setting to window mode. Yeah, he might not be quite as stretched out. Because the characters can look a little fat when they're stretched out. Alright, so there's Officer Loiter, Officer Blaze, and Officer Slack. They're all watching me. <laughs> so if I go attack mode. Oh, you see they got like a health bar, I think. So how do I attack? Is it? It just won't let me attack, I think. Looking good. Now go outside to the right and head north past the guards where your exit away. Okay. <laughs> My exit's a hole. Okay. So click. Ooh. Dark down here, isn't it? Right click to pick up that shovel and let's get digging. All right. Oh, right click. That's weird. I'm so used to like, like left click. Okay. Reinforced concrete. I'm going to break that with a shovel apparently. Let's say... Let's say, do I have to click the shovel? Okay. And then click dig. Okay. Digging on an empty space allows you to dig upwards and emerge from the underground. Digging on an empty space. But I can just dig the reinforced concrete. Is there? Oh, no, I can't. I dig there. Oh, okay. You dig there. Okay. Oh. Okay, I just went underneath the wall. Oh, Okay. When I, when I just started reading that, it said digging on an empty blah, blah, blah. I thought it said empty stomach. Like, okay, so hopefully I don't have to, like, eat stuff to keep my energy up or something in the game. And there's more stuff to watch for. Okay, that was fun. All right, so that was a tutorial. Um, let me go back. Oh, okay, so I could switch my characters if I wanted. Oh, look at that. 
I could pick I could pick different guys and give myself different names. Oh wait a minute. Oh no, I just clicked off of Tango and now apparently my name's gone. So I'm gonna change that back to SDG. New gamer. Alright, so what is oh continue would be go there. Okay, so the next level is center perks. Very easy. I will pick that up in the next video. Thank you for watching. I'm Super Duper Gamer. It's a pretty interesting game. We'll see if it's still interesting after the next video. Anyway, like and subscribe. I'm Super Duper Gamer. We'll see you next time.